a not-for-profit non-governmental organization, the International Federation of Biosafety Associations, IFBA, brings together a global network of stakeholders committed to a world safe and secure from threats posed by infectious diseases. Fundamental to this goal is the use of effective biosafety equipment in the laboratory setting. The Biosafety Cabinet is the principal containment device used to protect the laboratory worker and surrounding environment from dangerous biological materials. Despite this central role, many biosafety cabinets in use are not routinely tested and verified for correct functional operation and integrity. This process, referred to as certification, must be carried out by trained individuals and requires the use of calibrated testing equipment. In November of 2019, we spoke with Biosafety Cabinet certification trainees from the Southeast Asian region to gather insight into the challenges they face and identify solutions for improvement. My name is T. Ao. I am from Myanmar. Uh, my name is uh, Boradi Bai. I am from uh, Cambodia. My name is Silipon Vilatit, or you can call me Nina. I'm from Laos. My name is Chen. I come from Vietnam. My name is Nadia Tulhana Hajizul Kifli. I'm from Brunei Darussalam. My name is uh, Muhammad Fauzan bin Muhammad Rahmatullah. Uh, you can call me Fauzan. I'm from uh, Malaysia. In our, uh, our ministry or in our country or in our laboratory, there are many uh, infection organisms we have handling at the moment. So far, uh, there is no uh, local biosafety cabinet fee certifier in our country. Like in Cambodia, we, we don't have uh, equipment and we don't know uh, how to calibrate the, the equipment. There are no uh, the personnel who can certify the biosafety cabinet. Because uh, biosafety cabinet is the most important which uh, protect the, the user so we have responsibility uh, to do biosafety cabinet certification for other public health uh, laboratory and even also private laboratory. We have responsibility because uh, our laboratory is reference laboratory and also uh, administrative department. A lot of our work is mostly using biosafety cabinets. So it is important for us to make sure that um, uh, it is safe. Some equipment to certify by safety cabinets, we cannot um, calibrate. Um, example, for um, photometer or particle counter, no one in Vietnam can calibrate them, so we have to send out. We want uh, to make sure the, the safety of the user. Some, some people, maybe, they just see that the cabinet works so, so well, right? They just know that the flow comes out and the light works, and that's all. But they don't know how they have to maintenance, recertify. Yes, this is the big concern for us. So, uh, I will do first uh, the certification in my lab, and then we have uh, prepared to do uh, because it's uh, certification service to other laboratory. So I need to uh, train or teach or guide another uh, laboratory professional uh, to get uh, this uh, NSF accredited certifier. When I am the BSc certified, I can help people in our country to be safely to understand better on how the certification works and to, um, to uh, educate the other, um, the other, my other colleagues and the other relevant officers. I would like to be a teacher uh, who can give these information and a basic concern uh, or awareness of this to my colleague and as well to, to my to, to others, people in other institutions. I think we can, um, we can share the, the knowledge or, or experience for them to, to do the right, right way to certify the biosafety community. My goal to, for attending this workshop is 
to get uh, certified and then I able to go to my uh, firstly of course uh, I can certify the biostatic cabinet in my uh, institution and also can go to other institution to uh, to certify the biostatic cabinet and also to give the awareness training to uh, users and to doctors also the how the importance is the of biosafety cabinet itself Using biosafety cabinets that have not been properly certified presents a risk to infection among laboratory workers. It also presents a risk of release of infectious agents back into the surrounding community and environment, preventing global efforts to contain and control infectious diseases. The IFBA recognizes the importance of these risks and encourages national authorities to invest in a comprehensive program for the routine certification of biosafety cabinets. This requires that each country have a critical mass of calibrated testing equipment for use by competent personnel. For more information, please contact the IFBA at secretariat at internationalbiosafety.org.